Good day, Star Wars fans. Long live George Lucas era of Star Wars. If you are new here, welcome, welcome. I have been watching, researching, comparing, and contrasting the original lore to Disney Star Wars lore. I have shown disdain on a beloved title being used for a new miniseries, and that is Tales of the Jedi. Taking a very loved Old Republic story title to try to recreate a similar feeling to a different story era, hoping to appease the expanded universe fans they told aren't wanted anymore. The show has six episodes, mostly written by Dave Filoni. Those who don't know, he is the, the creator and director of The Clone Wars. The average runtime of Tales of the Jedi short stories is about 15 minutes, not a lot of time to develop a story or a character. The dialogue isn't very intriguing. Continuity is not in line with their own stories and lore. Clone Wars by Tartavosky, which had little dialogue with a short story and plot, gave more depth and development. Thinking about how I have disagreed with the title use, why did they not pay respect to the creator of the original and true Tales of the Jedi, Tom Veitch, whom passed away February of this year? No, he is not the only contributor, but is the main writer and developer of the stories. You would have thought Disney Lucasfilm would give a respectful note to the creator behind the original title they appropriated. After all, Tom Veitch and George Lucas created the Sith lore together. This brings to mind how Disney Lucasfilm praised Filoni for the Night Sisters and the Dathomirian Witches in a publication that came out on the passing of Dave Wolverton. It took people like Open Airlock Policy and myself to gain Disney Lucasfilm's attention to take notice and pay respect. Tom's passing was due to complications of COVID, leaving his daughter, Angelica Stasola, to organize a GoFundMe to help Veitch's widow, her mom, Martha, keep her home and medical care through the funeral expenses. As of now, I don't know any of the outcome. It is unclear if Disney Lucasfilm helped with any expenses. As we know, they can't honor contracts with their authors. Why would they reach out and help? This is clearly what a corporation does. There is no compassion and honor to who came before. They just want to suck the legacy dry. The titles even look the same. Don't be mistaken. The company and its lore is as disingenuous as its approach and handling of what came before. Let's hold them accountable for their actions. Rest in peace, Tom Veitch. Thank you for your contribution to the original Star Wars lore.